Back with Russ Maynard from Camp Pendleton Paintball Park, uh, now head of the uh, PSTA. Uh, director for Director, excuse me, director. Um, <laughs> that's almost like the CIA. <laughs> um, talking to you uh, about uh, when you had your field, you uh, used the barrel condoms when they came on out and um, used those specifically at your field, and you had some custom ones made. Talk to us about uh, the product itself, why you used them, and the, the quantity that you went through and why. Well, I actually switched over. Uh, at my field, I allowed barrel plugs and all that kind of uh, safety devices. But what I was running into was a lot of work. Uh, with barrel plugs, I didn't know what condition they were in. I didn't know were they missing O-rings, uh, how well they were put in. And I was concerned because when I'd be in the staging area, I'd look out on 100, 150 people walking around with paintball guns. I couldn't tell at a glance whether that gun had a safety device in the barrel. That bothered me. With the barrel sock, and I went with orange barrel socks, it was easy to tell. At, at 50, 60 yards, you could tell right away if a gun was safe or not. Did it have a, a barrel blocking device on it? It was real easy with a barrel sock to know that that marker was safe. So that was my primary issue. What I discovered was that uh, the barrel sock actually was one of the biggest sellers in my field. <laughs> I, I started out by saying, okay, we're, we're going to give it three months. I put up signs and said, in, in three months, we're going to change over completely. No more barrel plugs. Every marker had to have a sock. And I went through the process, educating my clientele, and, uh, and I finally did it. You had to use a sock. Of course, people would show up, and they had barrel plugs for their, for their markers. So we would, uh, we would loan out a barrel sock. If a person didn't have a sock, we would loan one out. What I'd do is I'd charge them like three bucks, deposit. Here's the barrel sock. Bring it back at the end of the day. We'll give you your three dollars back. And what I found is that Seven out of ten times, they just keep the sock. Because <laughs> they, uh, I think they, they learned to prefer the sock over a barrel plug also. So it was great. I was selling, I must have been selling like three, four hundred barrel socks in a month. It was, it was a very nice retail product. For me. And yours had your name on it. Yeah, I, I used it as an advertising. I had a, what I did is I put the website for the field, so I had cppaintball.com on it, and uh, you know I think that's a better advertising than handing out uh, cards or or, uh, or brochures. They have a barrel sock, and it's got the, the website on it, easy for people to remember. Did you use them for your rental guns also? Oh yeah, yeah, I put them on every single paint gun, and and again it was just. Uh, just to be able to see at a glance that everything was safe because we did a lot of private groups and in the private groups there would be a lot of kids who haven't played paintball before and they're going to forget or lose a barrel plug. But with a barrel sock, it could stay on the paint gun at all times. All they had to do was pull it and put it over the barrel. So it was easy for us to tell at a glance that everybody had their socks on. That's good. Would you recommend any of the other field owners to uh, use the Weekend Warrior barrel sock versus any of the other brands that are out there? And why? Gee, Did they last longer? Were they? I, w I was real happy with the life of the, of the Weekend Warrior barrel socks. I never had uh, strings breaking or seams coming out. They were overbuilt, and uh, and they were big enough that. Uh, you could tell at a glance, at like 50, 60 yards, it was on, and, and it had the bright color. I've seen a lot of different barrel socks and barrel plugs, and I didn't see anything that was better than what uh, Weekend Sports offered. So I just stick with them. The price was right, and uh, you know I could get a, my custom logo put on it. I was very happy with the product. Good deal.